Hi guys, just a short alternate picking exercise in the style of John McLaughlin. Just before we start, it really helps if you click the subscribe button and the like button, because that really does help for me to keep making these videos and keep the channel going. Anyway, now let's get down to the analysis. This 251 employs an added chord. This is chord 7, but it's a dominant 7th. So the chords are... And then... This B7, going to C, major 7. This line employs fragments of Jim McLaughlin's improvising technique. To begin with, we will start with an upbeat with an up stroke. Four, E, and a. So that when we land on the first bar, it will start on a down stroke. So four, down. So one, E, and a, two, E. Next we employ some more simple fingering and pentatonic movement. And now we just move the hand up, just slide it up, it doesn't do anything, the fingering doesn't change, it just moves up to the next position. And now, because we have this B7, we have a change of harmony completely and the fingering changes. So we have some barring here of a chord of F sharp major, which is a very John McLaughlin thing to do. That's extremely McLaughlin. And then we make this the dominant seventh by adding the A natural in. And there's the A natural there. And so, and finally land on the fifth of C, uh, with the note G by moving up a semitone there. So so slowly we have Anyway, if this video was of any use to you, then please smash the subscribe button because that really does keep the channel going. Click the like button because that really helps with the algorithm. Click the notification button if you like the video and write a comment if you want. And I'll see you all in the next video. And thank you for watching.